Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. My name is Parker. Today I've got loads to talk about in this video, including changes to the brand new map, secret items that were added to the game, and Atlantis City in Fortnite. If you guys enjoyed today's video, be sure to drop a like down below and please click that subscribe button. I'm on the road to 1,000 subscribers, so everyone helps. So without any further ado, let's jump straight into the video. So today we got our very first official update for Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 3. And really, they didn't tell us much, but we did get a secret item in the form of the Firefly Jar. And these are actually very rare and hard to find. I'm pretty sure the only way you can find them is at nighttime near water. And I think if you light a campfire, they will be attracted to it and you can find them more easier. But I have never found one in the game yet. And all they really do is you can throw them and then they'll light stuff on fire and it pretty much only wood. Metal will not burn, of course, and brick will not burn. So not very useful. And I think it will do 40 damage to players when hit directly with it. So good luck with this. I don't think it's an item I'm ever going to use and I'm probably never even going to find it in the game. So with that out of the way, moving on to map changes in the new season. So starting on July 1st, which is a little bit over a week away, the water levels on the map will actually lower. And here's a picture right here of the map. It's not unlocked yet, that's why it's all grayed out. But the water levels have lowered and new parts of the map are being revealed. And this will continue out the entire season, probably to the end of season three. So this is huge, because this could actually be revealing new locations on the map, who knows? And it will also give us access to the old locations from the last season like the shark because i know it is actually destroyed underwater since when this flood did happen when the storm broke of course it's going to destroy everything in its path that's why if you look underwater you can actually see like cars are tipped over trees are broken you know everything's tumbled over so we will be seeing that and being able to actually access it in future days which will be pretty awesome all right guys now the insane news so i made a video a few days ago about atlantis city in fortnite and this was just a complete theory of mine and if you guys haven't checked out that video yet click the card on the screen right now and go watch that because it's pretty cool but anyway guys i got some awesome news fort tory on twitter tweeted this out right here he said just found this in the files ambient volume biome atlantis there you go it's confirmed that atlantis will be in fortnite he also said does this confirm that we actually will get an atlantis poi just like deadpool and will it perhaps be the encrypted ruins poi time will tell that's true so deadpool did get his little yacht on the map and atlantis city is a go it looks like which i'm super excited about and i'm very glad my theory was correct and it appears it's actually just going to be the ruins of this city probably when the water levels do lower i have a feeling it is going to reveal the ruins of atlantis city and a new spot will be on the map so i really cannot wait for this location to appear on the map i think it's going to be really cool because aquaman atlantis city such a cool combo and hopefully we'll get more things in the item shop like maybe some music for aquaman something else maybe some other skins from the aquaman movie would be really cool while recording this video i got some crazy news guys hear this there's a huge chance of another aquaman related skin coming to the game so for tori on twitter again tweeted this out while looking for more atlantis references i found this quote female medium lady atlantis head Currently, that's the only file referencing to a female Atlantis skin, so we can't say a lot about it. But it is in the files, and with Aquaman, there are two different female characters in the movies. There's Mura and Atlanta. So there's no other information about when these skins could possibly come out, but they are definitely in the files. So guys, expect a new Aquaman-related skin in Fortnite. So that is going to do it for today's video. If you guys did enjoy, please drop a like down below and hit that subscribe button if you're new. Like I said, I'm on the road to 1,000, so every single subscriber helps a ton, and I really appreciate it. So thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye.